super big, amazing, super duper thank yous to our Patreon supporter, Old Abe. I temporarily forgot how to speak at the start of this shout out, but I'm leaving it in because Old Abe is so, 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 so nom. It just left me that speechless with how amazingly non old Abe is. I also want to shout out our producer Alice, of course. Her links are on screen right now. Make sure you check out Alice. She's an amazing nomkin. Oh my god! This is Trepang Squared. It is the uh, spiritual successor to Fear. F-E-A-R. Um, it's very good. And I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, maybe a bit less narrative than some of the playthroughs I do, but definitely an actually pretty good narrative here. If you're not into first person shooters, I do recommend sticking with it. I trimmed out all the side missions, so this is just the main story. And I think it's absolutely, excellently amazing. So uh, enjoy. Thanks for listening. And uh, plus to our Patreon. We need 18 more subs at any tier. One eight subs at any tier by the end of the month. Oh my God. All right, let's uh, check out. Trapang squared. Not to be confused with Trapang 2, which it doesn't exist. I'm gonna play on normal, I guess. I don't know if I'm meant to be watching this or pressing any key. It's a bit hard to gauge. I'll go press any key. So this is a spiritual successor to Fear, a game that I do not like very much. But hopefully I'll like this. We'll see. Maybe I'll think this is great. Trapang Studios and Team 17 present. What the fuck was that noise? All right. Let's fucking go with the trepang. Oh, our legs don't seem to want to behave. Oh, what? Oh, it looks like our leg is somebody else's leg. What the fuck? Hold security, this is Echo 3. What's your status, over? Not a lot. Hold security, I say again. What's your status, over? Security is not responding. I went invisible somehow. All units were under attack by unknown elements. Execute Operation Bright Star immediately. Wow, Operation Bright Star. I'm sure we're going to be fine, probably. Auto saves, lovely. Control bolt security is KIA. Subject one zero six has escaped. Oh no, stealth already? I just want to do something. I want to just tweak the audio a little bit because I think it's a bit loud. There we go. I think that's probably a bit better. The dot appears in the center of the screen when you're in shadow. Enemies will take longer to spot you. Great. I'm 
Okay, primary objective is this way. Probably should lay low here, I'm gonna guess, for a little bit. Oh, there's a lot of man. Oh my god. Alright, here we go. Oh, someone nearly saw me there. I'm not entirely sure where. Oh shit, down there. Okay. So they're individual visibility bars there for those bumpkins. Go, Neil, get them out! Alright, it's on you. Oh fuck. I'm booking it. I'm booking it! I think this is probably health. But let's go in here for now. Ha 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 ha. I looted them, they'll never fit in here. They're probably fine. I doubt it's a big deal. Security station, do you have eyes on 106? Security station, respond. I don't think the security station's doing too good, to be honest with you. I'm gonna be real. All units be advised, security station is not responding. Control, this is Echo 2. Should we go investigate? Negative Echo 2. You need to pull back and regroup with your team. Out. He's fine. Movement is very fluid. Mouse 2 is melee. Nice and easy. Wah! Um, this is Echo 2. We can't find subject 106 anywhere. Jesus Christ! Echo 2. You need to expand your search. Pick up Intel with F. Press I to view database. Adam, you're draft dodging the antidote. I can tell you're not doing a fucking part. You need to take your ass down to maintenance and fix those goddamn steam parks. Pipes. All right, make sure to bring eye, con eye protection. Jimmy got his eye gouged out over a valve combusted. Well, that's hyperbole, but it could happen, get it? So bring eye protection. You better be down there fixing those pipes, I swear, if I find you in the break room. I guess he came down to fix the pipes, and he's now... Oops, I went invisible again. Flashlight with T. For trash light? It's not like we're taking any damage, so... Yet. Might rebind the out. It's a bit hard to get to your left out. Don't really like it as a keybind. Check that room. Yeah, there's nothing here. Alright, stay behind and cover this entrance. Yeah, copy that. Hmm. Needs to take this guy out, perhaps? He's in a very unfortunate position for him. Okay.
Killing enemies will temporarily boost your stamina. Okay. Adrenaline pumping start here. My biggest problem with Fear Right is the lack of enemy variety across all the games. Like, it's just the boring fucking clones, and that's it. And they're not even scary, they're just shit. I know two has a few others, but That was pretty satisfying, I will say. Hmm. I think I'll take a shotgun. I like shotguns over rifles. I'm a big shotgun fan, you know, guys. Hang on. Can I swap it for the pistol? This one. So I have, like... Oh, I do. I can leave the pistol behind, take a shotgun and a rifle. Excellent! We're taking him down. A boomer shooter is referenced by the fact that it plays like a shooter from like the 90s. Even though boomers were significantly already old in the 90s. I'm going to leave those behind. Watch my back! Move it up! fun. Alright, let's see what happens when we get through this place anyway. As we appear to be able to slow down time and go invisible, I'm gonna guess that we're not conventionally human. In the conventional sense. Which would fit in if this was a fair spiritual successor, I will say. Hang on, this is where- I've already been here? I don't know. All the bodies look the same. No, I haven't been here. This is like a freezer. I have definitely not been here. Alright. Hi. Can I have your sword? I really want your sword. Don't really care about the disc that I'm looking at. <gasps> CV. I want the sword! Apparently the sword is a no-go. Collect the syndicate coin. <laughs> He 
see me go invisible there and they couldn't see me. That was pretty badass. I think I've lost quite a lot of health there though. Ammo was still okay on, but I definitely need some health. They're very squ- when they die, they get become very, very squishy and squelchy in this. Health would be numb. Any time now. Subject 106, we're to your position. You need to hold your ground. Jesus Christ. Well, that was a clusterfuck of chaos there. Christ, that's some intense fights here. Well, that was particularly fucking badass there, I feel. Site 14, this is Talon. We're on the way. Not a Talon team with British accents. We're fucked. We're fucked. We have grenades now. Excellent. Alright. Memorandum. Talon Company is a black operations unit under direct orders from the CEO. In the event that Site 14 is compromised, Talon Company will execute Operation Bright Star immediately. Once the operation has begun, you have exactly 30 minutes to extract all civilian personnel. Any remaining civilian personnel in the facility will be designated targets by Talon and will be terminated on site. Operation Bright Star was authorized by the board of directors to deny assets from falling into enemy hands. Any interference will be neutralized with extreme prejudice. All right, so they're sending in a cleanup team here, I guess, to get us. Take out sentry duties from Sierra 3 at checkpoint B13. The patrol is scheduled today due to snowstorm. Unidentified hail halo? Hail hello? Helicopter spotted about one kilometers northwest. Lost visual contact. Unidentified helicopter. Sierra 3 ends control notified. Control orders all Sierra units on alert. Weather conditions improve. Starting to patrol. Investigate helicopter's last position. Visual on smoke rising from forest. One kilometers, kilometers northwest from checkpoint. Moving to possible crash site. Arrived at crash site. Unidentified helicopter wreckage. No sign of survivors. Continue to investigate. Operation Brightstar initiated. All units recall back to site 14. Fucking arsehole. Throw grenades at me, the fucking arseholes.
so jammy and moist. Look at all the jam on my gun, Jesus Christ. Our legs are still fucking weird though. Evacuation drills. Paul, we've had four evacuation drills this week with no notice whatsoever. Do you understand it's hard to get things done with sudden alarms blaring and armed guards assuring us to the freezing cold helipad where we sit and wait for you to count heads for God knows how long? What in heavens is going on? Why the sudden need to practice with such an unlikely scenario? Is there something we should be concerned about? Not only is it disruptive, I have a heart condition, you know. The sudden loud noises and running are hazardous to my health. I would like to opt out of these activities if possible. Jam, 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 Are you panic shooting? Oh my god, that blood. Whoa! Let's change guns up. Jesus Christ. That guy just went to pieces. Like, literally. Weapon part. Quite a laser weapon part. Customize weapons. Oh, I see. You can add in, like, different stocks and things like that. Okay. And you can add scopes, potentially, to these things. Okay, I see. Another weapon part. Suppressor. Can I put that on this? It says it's locked on this one, I guess. I guess this gun can't have it. You can change guns out for different things there, too. Oh, shit. They got night vision. Cover me. Affirmative. That was fucking crazy. Holy shit. Well, that was fun. Wasn't that nice? A nice time? Nice little slide? Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh. Interface with drone. Hello, little drone. User identified. Subject 106. Location Black Site 14. Horizon Corporation. Accessing user's memories. Access attempt successful. Uploading. Data package. Subject 105. Termination. Upload complete. Incoming message. The cycle begins again. Capture means you'll be forced to complete your original mission. End of message. Press any key. Continue. Exiting program. What does that mean? Wow, this looks like a big fight room. There's health everywhere for a start. Looks like a boss fight potentially. We have confirmation that subject 106 is in the loading bay. Oh great. One, you need to move in now. Great. I think that might be us they're talking about. Don't know what gave me that crazy idea, but you know. Woo! Woo! Woo!
first squad done. Don't think they actually hit me. I've only got one shotgun shell left though, which is a shame. These guys definitely hit me. I like the way the music stops. Sierra 3? How many Sierras are there? 7,000? Oh, we demolished Square Sierra 3. He's every second thoughts! <laughs> this is great! Holy shit! I press the Windows key, shit. Go, 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 go. I need armor. Armor, good. Hell. Good. Final squad, I guess. Here we go. that noise high value target oh wow this guy's got armor Gotta shoot the thing on the back, I think. Jesus. This guy's super strong compared to the other guy, which is weird. Because he's not a special target. There you go. That was better. Oh, he's not dead? Now he is. Got the trophy Juggernaut, Killer Heavy Soldier. Three, watch for friendly fire. 106 is approaching the helipad. Make sure he extracts safely. Hi guys. Yeah, yeah, it's all me. Could have got here a bit sooner though, please, right?
This is Alpha 3. Raven and Enigma. Wow. Edgy names. Edgy as fuck names. Is it saying use your voice or something in the song? I say song in its loosest possible terms here. Bad subtitle choice here. Frightened now that you're free. You want vengeance. So do we. Welcome to Task Force 27. So I guess this is our base for whatever organization that we work for. Customize appearance. Can I make myself pink with huge boobs? Nah, curses. Foiled again. Let's go with flat black. Let's go edgy. Black and red. Oh yeah. You're one of us now. Is there no mirror or anything like that? I'm guessing. Head to the briefing room, and we can get started. Combat simulator. I don't know. I don't really care about that at the moment. Let's just go to the briefing room. Select mission. Oh wow, there's a lot of things. We have side missions and campaign missions. These are all redacted at the moment. Okay. The Pandorans are a high-tech end-of-life care facility ran by Horizon. Our undercover agent, Dr. Emerson, successfully infiltrated the facility but suddenly went silent. Assault the facility with other 2F27 teams to find out what's happening and rescue Dr. Emerson. All right, Edge Lord. Uh, can I can I get a can I get a name too? You're Raven. I can be uh, Shadow or something equally stupid. Oh, we got another weapon part here. A suppressor again. I want the shotgun and the rifle still. I think they're pretty good. I don't know what that does. We can add a suppressor to this as well, so they can't hear us. The damage and accuracy are reduced. Well, I'll take it for now. And we got the shotgun for, you know, blasting the fuck out of everything anyway, so... Uh, we'll see. <laughs> Horizon's good as dead now that you're on the team. Nomkin actually... Okay, you're right. Our code name will be codename Nomkin. Nomkin is a very edgy name, I will say. Why are you called Nomkin? Because they make everyone deadkins. Let's continue. This like loads instantly. Holy shit. Your objective is to rescue Dr. Emerson. Our intel says he's somewhere in that tower. Alright, we're approaching the Pandora Institute. Oh, is this gonna be like a uh, blood dragon? Oh shit! Yeah, um, it's a bit hard to tell what's going on right here. I'm gonna be honest with you. We're stopping here. Get out! We have more helicopters coming in. They can't land without AA gun active. Oh shit! All right, disable the AA gun. 
The top secret military base was well defended. I'm doing a surprise Pikachu face right now. If you're the guy sitting in to kill me, you're really unfortunate, really, aren't you? Let's be honest. End of life facility, top secret research lab, they're all the same thing. Shotgun again. Same one I'm using. Excellent. Do you like my red shoes, guys? It's the hide the jam stains. That guy got eviscerated, by the way. Like, absolutely fucked. Alright, gotta disable the AA gun. Oh, a pineapple. I'm allergic to most. Let's kick it. Probably should have defended this more, shouldn't they, really? Let's be honest. Nice attempt to kick there. Might be in trouble here, guys. Didn't sound good for him, did it? Oh, I took his leg off! Holy shit! That was so fucking cool! Okay, Jackal is a high value target. We gotta find him. Now watch your head. I'm dropping supplies. That was crazy shit. Thank you, Raven. You're so beautiful. I uh, got C4 charges to breach doors. There's a vending machine in there talking. Easy on the drinks there, buddy. Oh my god. Not quite sure what this guy's end game was there. Charles is down. Not Charles. This is like one of the best shotguns I've ever seen in a video game. Holy shit. Insertion point sounds lewd. <laughs> oh, hi guys, sorry. Sorry, sorry team. You scared me. Team Nomkin is in the house. Agent Nomkin, here we go. Run away. I'm having a great time. You know what? I'm just gonna go back to no suppressor because I like making a noise and killing everything anyway, so you know. Uh, nothing else I can do there. Any gun parts in here? Oh no. I can go down the vent. Oh my god! Holy 
Holy shit, I made him into a bomb by shoving a grenade up his ass! Only we can save the world. Let's get something. Oh, there's an item over there too. We need to increase our patient intake and reach our quotas. Be more aggressive in selling the benefits of the Pandora Institute to potential patients. Use your persuasive skills to recruit patients and family as well. Remember the patients we have, the better it is for science! Good old science. I've got a feeling they might have ulterior motives here, everyone, for having patience. I don't know where I get this crazy idea from. Oh, we have a gun with the scope now. LZ stands for lavatory, by the way, for those of you who don't know. I just slid the grenade along with me there, fucking idiot, for a minute. Oh, here's our crew, though. Here's the posse! That was a bit too high there. I went a bit crazy. Oh, maybe I still got him. That poor guy. Ancient Nunkin on the case! Oh, these are the people who died in the fucking facility! Why would you send your family member here? Where's the intel? Where, where's the intel here? Can you guys slow down with the names? We added 50 last week, running out of room on these walls, and we can't build more walls fast enough. Oh my god, they're just killing everyone! They were just killing anyone that came here! The wall of heroes, guys. Oh my god, I need a drink. No scope! No! Put a suppressor on here. What is this thing? Gun shots less audible, but damn it, uh, I don't care about that. I don't care about making more noise. God, noises. We can put a laser sight on this. Let's do that. Is that a safe? Oh no, it's a recycling bin. It's nowhere near as exciting.
I'm in trouble here. Oh, no health for the first time. Fortunately, there's some here. And armor. I don't like the heavies, they're hard to deal with. Is there two? I think there is. Woo! I'm on my way, just sit tight. Oh, the jackal's coming. The jackal! Not to be confused with the raven, the nomkin, or uh, Agent Pooh is the other one that we have. Don't ask how he got that code name, it's, it's not nice. Where do we go? This way? Yeah, oh no. Oh, we can use a charge. There we go. Turn off the laser grid in here, I'm gonna guess. Watch your back! I'm on the move! Somewhere in here? Over this way. There we go. It's probably nothing, that noise. Well, actually, I think it was someone setting off the trap, but still. Dylan Anderson? He is a hero! That is a lot of jam. That is a lot of jam. That is the jammiest jam. Oh, Jackal's here! Oh, this is not good. I'm pinned down. Jackal then, I think I might have done. No, I didn't. I can still see his tag. I can still see his tag. It's okay. We say Jackal Schmackal. That's what we fucking say. Jackal Schmackal. Ghost, barkeep, rags, gunslinger, and horse. Horse was the one that got the short end of the stick there with the name of it, I think. My gun name's Jackal. Yours is Goat. Welcome to the Pandora Institute. It took a lot of guts for you volunteers to sign up here. And for that, you have my gratitude. Countless lives will be saved because of your selflessness. Oh, a high value target here, too.
Well, Samaritan didn't go to, didn't last too long there. An alleged high value target. Yeah, fuck. No fucking way. No fucking way. Wow, this is where they keep all the bodies in this end of life place. I like the relaxing music, though. You know, it's in case any of them feeling a bit upset about their predicament. They can be like, oh well, you know. At least there's nice relaxing background music that I can be dead to. Experiments. I just picked up Dr. Emerson's signal. Hey! It's coming from the basement. Doc M! We need to find an elevator and take it down. Okay. Let's find one. I was like, I don't, I don't really like this room very much. I'm gonna be real. Why would you want to be here? I mean, I know that everyone here is probably not in a situation where they can choose to be here, seeing as their family has shoved them in it. But still. Hello? It's probably nothing. I'm sure there isn't horrific experiments creating monsters somewhere in the basement One of this zero building. Six. Man of the hour. Hi! I'll get that elevator unlocked for you. Ghost 2. I met Ghost One earlier. Is he better than you, or are you better than him? Like, how's the ranking there. order work? I got it. According to the schematics, this elevator is going to take you straight to the basement. It's probably <laughs> all right. Good luck. <laughs> Going to B nine. Pandora Institute. Bum nine. You calling me fat elevator? They're on the roof. Fat shamed. Fat shamed by an elevator. I think that might have been our first supernatural occurrence, by the way. Wow! Okay, I don't think this was in our plans for what might have happened here, but I'm guessing there was something really bad in this basement. Just a hunch. Just just a crazy hunch that the supernatural aspect of this is coming into play more now. It looks like a security lockdown is in effect. We need to find a way to disable it. Not gonna talk about the hordes of dead bodies piled up high around here, no? Okay, that's fine. I for one am glad these PCs are using Horizon OS. Hang on, was it Intel? There was. I hope this message finds you well. You must be worried about my well-being since I haven't contacted you in some time. I'm doing fine, but my illness is in its final stage and unfortunately I will pass away soon. As much as I'd like to hear from you, please respect my privacy at this time. You'll receive my belongings and some forms that require you to signature on my behalf. Please sign those forms and mail them back. It means a lot to me. Your husband, Alex. I think they're making fake messages, by the way, to send out to family members. Dear parents, I hope this message finds you well. You must be worried about my well-being since I haven't contacted you in some time. I'm doing fine, but my illness is in its final stages. This is the same letter! Oh my god, it's like they're faking that the people are being actually dying of illnesses and instead they're just killing them and using them in experiments. Oh my god, so bum. But yeah, I feel this is like... I'm enjoying this more than I enjoyed Fear, I'll tell you that. Like, I know f I know Fear for a lot of people is one of the most iconic horror games of all time, and I do get it, why it is. It's the same message, yep. Oh, it says error relationship unknown, so I didn't know if it was who it was sending it to. But yeah, like, I know Fear is seen as one of the most iconic horror games of all time. I never quite saw it, but this is definitely a, a step more in the, f in the right direction, you know. I feel like I feel like this has been so far very intense and also the horror aspect has been nicely introduced here. This is gonna go there's something really bad's gonna happen down here, I'm gonna guess. Dr. Green, you have a visitor. 
So is this made by the same people who worked on Fear, or is it just a completely independent project that just tries to be like Fear? Because it, obviously it plays almost identically to Fear does. This is a lockdown. Look at the jam prints everywhere, how rude. Lockdown sequence aborted. Reinitializing facility. Shooter side at a checkpoint, Maxwell. Houston reports was over here. Oh, it's the thing! It's the thing! That looks suspiciously like the vagina dragon from uh, Dark Souls, but as a man. Alright, don't kill the alien. Whatever the fuck it is, got it. I'm alright with not fighting the horrific thing that just ate a man in front of me. I'm gonna be honest with you. Let's just find Dr. Emerson. I understand that you may have concerns about the morality of our research, but it's important to remember the potential benefits for thousands of lives. We have a duty to push the boundaries of medicine and science, and it is essential that we do not let personal feelings get in the way of progress. Remember that our ultimate goal is to save lives and improve humanity as a whole. It looked like it managed, it like lifted back its entire like, stuff, like torso, and then consumes him with the front of the torso. Which is interesting. I think, I'm assuming we're going to have to follow it, because this door wasn't open before, by the way. Unfortunately for us. This is where it went. A delicious torso. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that guy's got acid on him as well. So maybe it can shit acid? It's always shitty when things can sh Something can see me here. Hi! I think you might be alive! Oh, this is bulletproof glass. Okay, I thought it was a cage. Hi! Is it gonna break through? I'm assuming it's gonna break through. Yeah. Alright, we have men made of acid. Excellent. Probably wasn't on my list of things that I expected to find down here, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, but... I'll take it. Oh, it's a drone. Hi. Hi, little guy. Subject 106, location Black Site 97, Pandora Institute, accessing user memories. Access attempt successful uploading. Pandora Institute, evidence of anomalous research, upload complete. It was never going to be a rescue mission. Downloading file, confidential. To Robert C. Kramer, from Anton Laser, we have a defector. Our last two containment breaches were no coincidence. Laboratories 13A and 13F are both adjacent to maintenance access delta. Only one person in recent access logs, Dr. Emerson. Recommend covert surveillance until we find out who he was working for. All right, so they know Emerson's bad. No, they know Emerson's on our side and is betraying them. Excellent. Emerson, more like Dedison, probably. Dr. Kaufman, pick up line three. Dr. Kaufman, please pick up line three. Where is Dr. Kaufman? Does he not care about his job? Or his patients? That doesn't sound good. Well, then it sounded like someone playing like a fucking WMV of someone screaming. On a loop in the background. I cannot stress enough the importance of thoroughly testing and evaluating our biomaterial before releasing it to the public. You must not compromise the safety and well-being of our customers for the sake of beating our competition to market. I urge you all to remain vigilant and to prioritize the safety of our people above all else. Well, isn't that nice? All personnel, reminder, report to check they do care. For oh, they have hot dogs? I knew I'd want a... Oh, look at that. <laughs> Fresh coffee looks pretty good as well. I'm not gonna lie. I don't care about this shit. This looks garbage, but this... Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm not a big fan of cake. Oh! Well, this doesn't look good. I kind of don't want that hot dog anymore. Especially as I hear people being born in this room.
gonna enter my armor. kill a bunch of these, you get a bunch of them. I don't like that sound. having a little party over there. Reasonable. I would have a little party too. I mean, this is... This would have been a nice canteen if it wasn't, you know... Covered in shit. This is probably lime jam, I just realised. Holy fucking shit. The worst... Not the worst kind, actually. I think Chrism would probably say the black currant's worse than lime. Eh... Uh, you know, you gotta weigh out the pros and cons. Like, I feel like Americans are biased against black current, so like, you know. Well, this is a nice facility, isn't it? Lovely. Oh, huh. I didn't mean to go invisible there. Let's not do that. Checkpoint Maxwell. Good to meet you. I hear something whining. Or gurgling. Gurgle whining? How do I still have full armor? I have a lot of ammo at least for this gun now. I think we'll be good for a while. This is the same shotgun. At least I got some ammo for it from that though. Alright, where the fuck am I going? Like, this looks horrible. Look! Look at the fucking pustules! I don't like pustules. No one- who do I, Does anyone like pustules? No one! Oh, hi! Hey, at least it's wings and not it's ribcage. Oh god, it's like a fucking owl! Oh, hi. That's not good. Not gonna lie, I did not expect that. We've gotta run. We're being chased. Woo! Oh, great. Don't really have time to check in on him at the moment, I'm gonna be honest with you. Ah! That was really stressful, but really fucking cool. That was a really cool little chase sequence. It felt great. Like Oh hi. He's dead. There's nothing we can do for him. Pick up his flash drive. <laughs> he's dead, but he's got an erection. <laughs> Oh, another one of these. Your next objective is to destroy the subject. Horizon's gone too far. We can't let this thing escape. That sounds like a not gonna work plan. Okay, that's just manifest. I've got a plan. Oh. You'll be going down to the reactors next. Oh. This is a lot of guns. There's a lot of guns. Like, more than four. 
Holy shit. Eh, I'm just gonna keep things how they are, for the most part. I hear the owl! Owl! Oh, we're gonna, we are gonna nuke the site, so like, the, we're not gonna fight it one on one, although I presume it's gonna come for us. I can hear it screaming. Yeah. You right, guys? You right, lads? I'm really enjoying this, though. It's very, very, very fun to play. Hang on, is that some intel? Yeah, it is. Let's read it first. Get those laser gates turned on ASAP, you just heard from the eggheads. If one of those things gets inside a reactor, the whole place is going up in flames. Sounds good! Jeepers, creepers, where'd you get those papers? Where'd you get those papers? And suit. This is, this, this music's bad. Okay. Oh, great. Find in per infected personnel, throw them into the reactor. Got it. One down. <laughs> what the fuck? I can't grab these ones. They need to be in slow motion. I just realized, which is not good. Let's get my stamina back and they'll come and join me. Grab him! Grab him. I might die here. Grabbing is not. Very good. Yeah, I'm not getting any fun. There we go. Alright, one more. Get in there. Where's the next one? There's one up here, okay. There's more health up here though, too. Come on. Someone come up here. Come on, you fuck. I'm up here! Look for a way out. Hi! Hi! Slide under his legs! Or don't. Why would it still be giving me health and shit?
No, we can't. My face has been eaten, but other than that, I'm fine. Not even one week since your escape, but you've already destroyed one of my facilities. Enter our bad guy. One thing clear, six. Uh, the name's Numkin? You were never supposed to be a weapon. Okay. Horizon survivors now. We'll arrive momentarily. Elevator's coming up. Wait. Picking up a signal from 106. Thanks, Ghost 2. I like you more than Ghost 1 now. He's a loser. You're still with us. We're almost done. Just getting everyone ready to extract. It's gonna be one hell of a debrief. Talk about briefs, huh? Thank you, Elf on his way now and Nuke. You first. <gasps> Nuke? We'll see you at the helipad. Nuke? The Nuke? Oh no, that was cheap! It literally is a moth man, I just realised. My One of my biggest fears. I'm really glad it isn't furry, otherwise I'd really be like, freaking out, to be honest with you. It has a health bar now. Oh, that's great. There's fucking horde of them coming. And I got knocked. Could be in a lot of trouble here, guys. I'm gonna be honest with you. Ah, oh, the bullshit range on this guy is crazy. Save it. Alright, let's go and get that last bit of health we saw. He's nearly dead, I think we can take him. Change guns though. Oh, I've got eight shotgun shells actually. Got him. That's what Horizon's hiding behind closed doors. Monsters. Uncontrollable experiments. All hell breaking loose in their own facilities. They try to justify it all, saying their research will change the world. So that level was better than any single level in Fear 1, by the way, by miles. Like, it was just, it was just great. It was just fucking great. Alright, next mission is the Jorvik Castle. This unlocks the shotgun to, like, use when I want as well. We're going to England! We're going to York Yorkshire, England. Let's go to Yorkshire, England. I do love Yorkshire. It's my favorite place. Oh yeah, I can't choose a shotgun yet. So I'll take the... I'll 
lieutenant rifle. Yorkshire? Those cultists are a bunch of freaks. You'll see what I'm talking about. For those wondering if I'm, why, why I'm saying it like that, and for those wondering why are you saying it correctly and trying to make a big deal out of saying it correctly, it's because it's pronounced Yorkshire. Wow, we just dropped in in Yorvik Castle in Yorkshire, United Kingdom. We just we were just there. I didn't even mean to skip the cut. I don't know if I skipped the cutscene. I just pressed start and we were just here. Wow. Well, we got a castle to kick us in. Anything interesting? Yeah, fuck you. One zero six, you made it. We're here to back you up if things get heated. Thanks, Spectre. You take the first shot. Under the Patriots' right, we are protected. Yeah, who needs cover? Where are you? You Covers for nerds. What happens if I go down there? Can I just fall? Fuck it, let's try. Die! Yes, is the answer to that question. Hi. Clear. Holy shit, he died brutally then. Execute the trespassers in the name of the patriarch? There's a cult! My favorite thing. Oh, they even wearing like little cult masks. Little, little numbers. Oh, that was his brain there. Did you see that? And oh, he shot his brain out his skull. Holy shit! Oh, we have fireball ones. I'm not quite sure where that guy's going. Well, that answers my question here. Yeah. I think I might have shot that fireball while it was in his hand. What if he just got- Oh my god, that blood was nuts. Holy shit, that was fucking crazy! Hi. His arm off. All right, the cultists have decided to run away. I didn't do it. I didn't touch it. <laughs> God, look at the jam on this white armor. I'm really glad I chose it. All right, Spectre 2. This is our stop. Go fuck shit up. All right, got it. Spectre oh, it's just health? I don't need health. That's for babies. All right, Gunslinger and Ghost. Have fun. Fuck up the Enforcer 106. And Wolf and Guide. I thought it was like glue from it. I was like, you got the short end of the stick. And Nimble, that's a bit of a shit one. Bang! Bang is pretty badass. Doctor, eh, if they're a medic, I guess that's fine. Barkeep is just shit. It means they've just got an alcohol problem. I guess we gotta kill the big boss guy. 
wonder if we'll find out any more information about the cult if we just wander around here a bit. Ah, well there he is. He's behind bulletproof glass though, the fuck. Doesn't really work like that, I'm gonna be honest with you. I mean, you might have convinced your followers that that's the case, but I'm probably gonna just kill them all, to be honest with you. I mean, like, oh, 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 the intel in this mission scrolls because we're in England and we only write on paper here. Today marks my first day as an apprentice. I've left my old life behind, including my job at Horizon. I made the decision not for myself, but for my wife, Martha, and our unborn child. I believe the Patriarch offers something that my old life could not. True purpose and fulfillment. Well, that's going well, isn't it? Hmm. Softly, brothers. The non-believers are Bless! Your brother has fallen! Oh, I was gonna grab that guy, but I didn't go well. My weapon's jammed! Your weapon's jammed? Oh my god. I'll make your weapon even more jammier. Come here. The heathen's There you go. And then he just caught off mid explosive scream. What a man. Oh, I love the fact you can cut them off mid sentence. Ages ago, I left my old life as a soldier behind in search of something greater. I joined not because of my beliefs, but also because of a sense of belonging and fulfillment that I never found in my previous life. I used to have nightmares about my past. My, uh, memories of a war that haunted me, but now I only dream of dying in battle for the Patriarch. I'm ready to give my all for this cause. My death will not be in vain. It looks like everyone that works is in this cult used to be working for Horizon. Which is very convenient. But they've left Horizon to join this cult, which I'm guessing Horizon probably isn't that chill with. They don't seem like the kind of organization that, you know, just lets you go with a care package if you want to quit your job. You know? Many moons ago, we were led by a council of elders, but it was not long before a powerful figure emerged known as the Patriarch. Under his rule, we'd become a formidable force and waging war against the nefarious Cabal. I don't know who the Cabal are. Are we the Cabal? I'm not entirely sure, I'm gonna be honest with you. Jarvik Castle, built by the fierce Vikings and occupied by the Romans, later by wealthy British noblemen who excavated it and made it their dwelling. Now it serves as our sacred temple. Mysteriously, all previous inhabitants have vanished after residing within its walls. The castle's history is rich and fascinating, and we, the librarians, shall keep record of its past for future generations to ponder upon. Listen, if I was a librarian, I wouldn't... I'd, like, want my group to be called something cool, like, not librarians, you know? their best. You know, they're like, they didn't know that I was going to come in here, and they're all chill. They're like, just reading their books and doing some librarian in, 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 in. That's what you call it, right? I don't think Enforcer is very happy about the fact that they're getting go. I will say, you shouldn't be too mad, Enforcer. I am literally a superhuman. 
The fixed stone wall shall protect me and mine from the radiation. I shall stock provisions of food, water, and medicine. I shall also tend a garden within the courtyard and teach my companions to purify water and forage for sustenance. Discipline and order shall be upheld for the survival of us all. Uh, will it though? My precious warrior monks, you arrive seeking answers. As your supreme patriarch, I provide enlightenment. I witness your growth from humble peasants into noble crusaders. Every day you sharpen your swords, sharpen your minds, purge blasphemous influences from your lives. Today you face the enemy with the unflinching resolve. Even in your final fiery breath, show no doubt or hesitation. The destruction of the Cabal is imminent. To arms, my holy warriors, to arms! I didn't mean to go invisible there. It just sort of happens. Like, don't you just hate when you accidentally go invisible? I was going to say, they're going to blow themselves up, aren't they? That went well. I will say, they're definitely more aggressive than most librarians that I've met. You know. I'm now five days into my apprenticeship at the cult hall, and I must say- Why are they Okay, if you're in a cult, you're not going to call it a cult. You're going to call it the religion, or the truth. The schedule is quite rigorous, rising at the crock of dawn, praying for four hours crack of dawn, four hours fasting and so on. It takes some getting used to, but I believe it for the greater good. The hall itself is quite impressive, but where are all the women and children? Martha is not enjoying herself here, but I'm sure she'll be accustomed to herself in due time. Oh, do they kill women or some shit? I wish you could fully actually... Oh, is, the the is this Dr. the first time we've met Spectre 3? Good luck bagging the Enforcer 106. Yeah, thanks guys. It'd be nice if you, you know, fucking did something as opposed to just, you know, looking cool. Oh, hi! There's the posse. There's Spectre 3. Still like Spectre 2 the most. Hello? Those chairs are made of, like, paper mache. Holy shit. Oh, I ran out of bullets now. For the fun gun. Well, I mean, the shotgun's fun too, actually. I shouldn't complain too much. Like, I would... I like the shotgun a lot. It's one of the most fun shotguns I've seen in a while. They're all so squishy, though. You know, they're all so, they're all so, you know like... Are most cultists this squishy? Like, is this a normal cultist thing? They're a lot squishier than the other people I've been shooting. They're a lot more oozy as well, I feel. Is that another side effect of being in the cult? More ooze? It's probably. Hi, guys. Nice try. On... Oh, hi. That's, this is going to be a nice try. That was fucking insane. That was fucking insane. Maybe the most insane moment so far. Holy shit, that was fucking great. That was amazing. The slide into the mine. I don't want to change guns, god damn it. I want to read this. I want to read the scroll. Could be something key important. Like, today we had breakfast. Become a martyr for the cause. Today I learned to make powerful pie bombs to destroy my enemies and bring about true unity among brothers. This is the end of my journal and the beginning of my legacy. Wow. What a little bitch, baby. Oh, we've got a boss fight. Oh, fuck! I mean, I just killed you, fuckface. Well, you, I think you might have escaped, actually, because you've done, like, half oh. health, right?
I think he might have escaped. He'll come back in a minute, probably. Okay, he's back. The false prophet cut from the Oh! What a little bitch, baby. And a new gun. He got fucked. I like the way he was yelling until I shot his face off, then he stopped. Get your hands off me, you fuckwits! Bastards! I think it's going fine. Dr. Kramer is in custody. We're on our way back to the courtyard for extraction. Director, we've got unidentified helos closing in fast. Oh shit, look. Yeah, there's a big posse oh, coming. shit, it's Horizon! They're landing everywhere! We'll try to hold them off, but we're going to need backup ASAP! Let me out, please. I'm just a non-human. No one's noticed me, by the way. I'm just standing in this window right underneath them. I'm not a child. I can walk on my own. Take your fire. We've got a VIP to look out for. You're covered. Go. Uh, I can't shoot. Why the fuck didn't I shoot there for like a good few seconds? It was like it was delayed big time. That was weird. Mm, he's dead now anyway. Our first priority is to rescue Dr. Kramer. Secondary objective is to recover his research. Avoid subject 106 at all costs. Oh, they're trying to avoid me? Babies. Okay, so the cult was aligned with Horizon. But they have backstabbed at each other. This gun won't shoot half the fucking time. What's going on? It's like it's got a massive delay. I get oh, that was a chair. I thought it was a person. Up on it. Wow. He did not last long there, did he? I hear bumpkins. So it's quite a cool gun, but at the same time, eh. Let's go over there. Wow. No one saw shit, okay? Central, Dr. Kramer spotted. No Go one saw sick. anything. Take I didn't fuck it up, up, okay? We've got Horizon Black Ops on our tail. We're headed underground. We'll find a place to hold out. I think I'm watch out. Baby's first grenade. I see you running upstairs, you fuck. Woo! Hi. Oh! Oh, shit, son! It's just goo! He's just a little goo glob. Absolutely no idea where I'm going there, by the way. This looks promising. Oh, my God. I was gonna say, they don't want me going here. Could 
Did I just hear a voice go, are you alright? Of course he's a fucking alright. He's like you. Oh, we got a boss fight? Or a mini boss fight? He said, fuck face, it's just you and me. There we go. Alright. Hi! Let's be friends. <laughs> oh my god, what a little numb king. Oh shit, something's happening though, story wise. Okay. All of your predecessors lie dead, and so will you if you continue to walk in their stead. Listen, dude. Spare me the sin of killing another brother. Heed my warning. He's got a little cough. Doing a little. Oh, thanks for telling me as I run out into the courtyard like a complete dickhead. I will say this is a very fun gun to use when you're actually like using it, but uh, very impractical gun as well, you know what I mean? Spectre 2. It's definitely something hopefully fun. I guess we'll find out shortly. It's worth testing out. Haven't used it yet, so you never know. Aha! More deep intel. We're not proud of our collaboration with the Horizon Corporation, but their sacrilegious technology shall aid us in our quest for knowledge and power. We've already converted some of their staff to our cause, and their CEO, a young and ambitious man, reminds us of our own patriarch in his prime. Together we shall unlock secrets and ascend to glory. But isn't using something you consider blasphemous probably really, like, against the rules of your weird cult shit? Well, whatever. They're not, they're not very, they don't have much conviction. The fact that people are dead down here concerns me a bit, by the way. We've got more horror bits coming up, I think, guys. Three, this is central. Come in. Do you read? Damn it. If you're reading this, rendezvous with Dagger 5. Okay. It, I'm now supervising the cult's experiments. It's my job to gather data and assess if there's anything usable in their insane methods. I report every 30 minutes if I miss one or if my heart rate wants to go too high. A Black Ops team will arrive and kill everyone, leaving no traces behind. I must remain objective. The cultists are fanatical and delusional, but there's a chance that some of their methods may prove useful. So this is literally what's happened. We went in and we triggered like the Black Ops team because we took Dr. Kramer away from where he was meant to be. Oopsie! We made an oopsie doopsie, guys. This looks bad. Yes. 
This looks bad. This looks really, really fucking bad. Dr. Kramer's dead. I kicked his body. He's just nothing but goo. So what are we looking for? Just shit? I don't like this environment. It's very unpleasant. You know it's all gonna kick off in this room in a second. It's like, this is creepy shit. Good. I mean, no, shit! Okay. I just realized they're all friends. Oh. I'm doing my best, but you know. So, where is the Spectre 3? Oh, I hear the beep. Is he up here? Is he above me? There's a staircase there, hang on. Oh, it's his head. Wait, what? Okay, okay. It's heavily corrupted. I'll try to stream oh, it's his helmet, not his head. I thought it was his head. I was like, okay. It's just his helmet. I was like, wow, he's not going to be that alive without his head. This seems bad. Is he going to be like Yanis? The, the, the Roman god. Great. This is going to be bad, right? Okay, about 10 of them just died then in one shot. Holy shit. Hi. Okay, this is really fun to use with the destructible scenery. Hi guys. That was very fucking close there, by the way. Got some health back at least. Oh, the fire guys are here now, great. That was crazy. The ritual's complete? What the fuck does that even mean? It's probably nothing, right? Um... Hail the flesh golem! What? What the hell? I'm picking up the signal. It's Spectre 3 actual. He's wounded. But it's he's not Spectre 3. It's the flesh golem that's been made into Spectre 3. has been... This is really bad. You ready, guys? To die? Oh my god, I got fucked. 
When was the last save? I hope it was recently. I'm not entirely sure what happened there, by the way. was last time. Whoa, he's coming through the wall. Woo! This is like a super grenade launcher. Not really sure the best situ best way of dealing with this spot, really. Oh, he's doing to get over here. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Holy shit! Super soldier. Nothing else we can do here. Final task is neutralizing the patriarch. Oh, I'm gonna fucking neutralize him fucking good. I'm gonna neutralize his fucking face! What am I doing? Oh, the other way. Probably should take a different gun though. Like one I can use. Alright, just the Patriarch left. Oh, hi! So it's true. You really are just like me. He can do bendy shit too! The question is, are you any better? Huh? Well, he fucked off. I thought we were gonna fight. What a pussy. I clearly am the better one. I clearly am a nonkin. I am THE nonkin, in fact. They call me Agent Nonkin. At the courtyard. Oh, great. We're moving to intercept. Sounds like it might be a terrible Negative. idea. Hold fire, Spectre One. Wait for 106. I mean, I would, I'd like to be there now, ideally. Out the way, stupid bodies. That's not just because they're dead. Oh, inject serum. Dual wield serum. Oh shit! We'll be able to hold a gun in each hand? We can dual wield weapons? Fuck yeah. Find another weapon of the same type and press H at the same time. Oh, I wish I had more. Is there any knocking around? No, it's just upgrades. I can only customize the weapon here. We were very keen to inject that. Oh, it, they try, they do it here for you. Look at this. Look at this. Isn't that nice? I pressed the wrong button. Shit. And set myself on fire. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Badly. I have an incendiary shotgun upgrade? I didn't even notice. Holy shit, it's even better. Are you fucking kidding me? The Patriarch's escaping! Get the guns from their terror team! Alright boys, time to kick some ass. Oh, oh he thought he got away! No fucking luck here for you, fuckface!
convenient. By the way, on that is nuts on this gun. He's right over there. We could do a different gun. I'll take this. I know it's some wielding, but. Just, just, gonna, just gonna kill everything. When in doubt, fucking shoot everything you can. All the time, as much as you can. I actually got somebody as well. Hi. I've only got two bullets left in the shotgun though, which is sad. Hi. Bullets, thank fuck. Am I not at the monument? I was gonna say. Crazy shit, holy fuck. You really want to kill me this badly? I mean, this is the commission objective. I'm sorry, it's, not, it's nothing personal. Nothing personnel, kid. But, yeah. That was bad. Nothing personnel. But this looks like the prelude to the boss fight. Excellent. What do we have here? A penetrator. Well, that actually sounds like it might be useful. Depends what he goes on, though. Incendiary! I see. Okay, we have the incendiary shotgun. I don't think this is going to be particularly useful in this fight, so let's go to this. And... Eh, just keep this standard. Alright. In we go. I'm running at you! It's like the opposite of a coward. You've been super fucking badass. Nice try. 
like the way that fire guy was there. It's very fun to shoot all these guys. Very, very satisfying. Nice try. Did you just grenade the wall near you? That's really stupid. Like a piece of your brain on my face, lovely. Hi. Didn't mean to do that button. There we go, that's what I wanted. Alright, where am I going from here? Maybe across here? Oh, actually, I actually have no idea. Do I drop down, perhaps? Oh, hi guys. I'm looking for the guy who runs this place. You know where he is? Alright. That was a bit cringe, I'm sorry. I ran straight into a trap. Fortunately, it just saved at the same time I ran straight into the trap. Which is just as well. It's right here. Are they all British, these guys? Oh, it's just such a ride out here. Oh, the Patriarch's here. We're actually here. Shit. Well, I could be dead here. At least once. Or maybe not. Listen, I need to go and kill your boss. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, Patriarch, here we come. He's through the door. Oh! Sarkatos! Dog shit! Mimimus! He appears to be made entirely of fire. It's a day of grieving. You are the second brother I must kill. This is probably gonna really suck, I'm gonna be honest with you. Let's see how badly this goes though. Right, that's phase one I guess. Yeah, we got auto save already. Oh, he's got friends, that's cheating. It's almost as if he runs a cult or some shit. Health boss going down really fast, dickhead. So yeah, I already got to the next phase. Yeah, I get fucked. Even in our darkest hour, my sons come to defend me. Can the syndicate say the same to you? What the fuck is that? Oh, is that a flesh golem? I knew I was fucked there. At least I got a save. Got a save just before the flesh golem showed up and ripped my fucking face off. How am I alive? 
How do I not take crazy? Okay, I did take crazy damage. It was just eventually. Oh, you're the Patriarch. Oh, I don't have to kill the Cobra. And if I do... <laughs> the timing of those explosions! This guy was pretty easy. Some cool visuals there, though. Alright, mission three complete. We managed to guess if Exo survivors from Spectres 1 and 2. What a fucking mission, sir. <sighs> that was a stressful level. Not much time left for more than huh? Good, good for me. Wow, three fucking side quests. I will probably do these off stream now. Four side quests. Crash site, unidentified structure, oil rig, and Kellington Quillery. And the next mission is in Siberia. How many levels does this game have? Does anyone know? All right, guys. I am now off stream. I was on stream before, as you probably told by some of my responses. I've mopped up the four Horizon extra side quests that spawned off camera. Oh, just shut up. I just, I just got some cargo from a plane crash and shit that belonged to Horizon. Uh, most of the missions were boring as fuck. There was one that was kind of cool, but it still was a little sort of like too much shooty shooty, not enough talky talky. Uh, but it was okay. Uh, so generally, these side missions have been pretty mid. Uh, they range from really boring to okay. <clears throat> but anyway, we now have done everything except Site 83, so let's go there. Horizon repurposed its former Soviet military base into a research facility nearby civilians regularly today under the cover of a gas leak. We're sending in a small team to investigate. Sounds good. Copy that, 106. Hilo is ready to go. Let me just start my guns. I've unlocked a bunch Stay more guns and shit now, though. So this was worth doing. See? Okay, so we got now we got now, now we've got a DMR by default. We have the shotgun, we have a grenade launcher, we've unlocked proximity mines, we've unlocked tomahawks, which have become my favorite fucking thing. Um, we're also gonna take, well I may as well fill up my armor, and let's take, I'm gonna take the shotgun, I, I really like the shotgun, and I can add the incendiary thing to it, which is just amazing. Let's see what I can add to the DMR, I actually didn't think about it before, but we have the laser. Extra little bit of aiming power Go would be good. On this mission. Good luck out there. All right, side 83. Let's see what monstrosities they're cooking up here. We've had flesh golems and mothmen. That was a bit weird from Raven. There, you remind me of the last guy I flew. The the the, uh, the other guy said break the cycle, right? The um. You're wearing gas mask, it'll limit your movement speed and stamina. Yeah, um, I had this one in the, uh, one of the side missions and it was incredibly obnoxious. So we stuck with it probably for the whole mission. Lovely. But anyway. So far I think Director, the main missions have been excellent. The side missions meant. Looks like it's still operational. 106, you're the first one in. Phantom 13, 14, back him up. Alright. Agent Nomkin on the case, as always. That. 
the Phantom 1, 3, and 1, 4, who are Killjoy and Butler. Better with miserable kills. Right? Signal's getting spotty down there. Remember to recon the area and report. Reception's fucked. Looks like we're on our own here. You two are totally dead, by the way. You're not main characters. <laughs> Losers. Hello. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn. Okay. I stop for a moment there. Yeah, one of the side missions had you infiltrate this bar, this research facility under this barn in the middle of nowhere, and there was like a gelatinous glob in there that was whispering creepy messages. But all that happened was tons of soldiers showed up and tried to kill me. It wasn't that exciting. It could have been really cool. It had a definite like SCP vibe to it, and this game does have a little bit of an SCP vibe. I would love a proper SCP game, not containment breach, but like one where you're a recon squad bringing back famous SCP. Anyone still receiving? It's cool. Dead air. Hmm. The gate's automatic. We need to find a switch or something. Very elaborate, I'm sure. Uh, I think it's in this room, the one right next to me. All personnel must don gas marks and CRBN suits immediately. Shelter in place and await further orders. If you experience auditory or visual hallucinations, disarm yourself and report to security immediately. That sounds excellent. I'm sure nothing bad's gonna happen in this place. Wow, we're an electrician. We're a professional what are we electrician. What the fuck? Where the hell is everyone? I'm gonna go on a limb and say they're dead. Zero employee satisfaction surveys have been filled today. Huh. Oh, shocking. Well, this is more than a little bit airy, isn't it? Eerie? Air eerie, not airy, eerie. I wouldn't like to be paired with the super soldier. I'd, I'd be fairly sure I was going to die. HR. 176 job positions are now vacant. The store's been barricaded. This is all so the running on low power, but the damn PR system won't shut the hell up. Cut you said shatter. PR, but it's PA. Subsell has got it right. Cut the shadow be like 106. Be a silent protagonist. These are just helmets, they're not severed heads. It's always a bit confusing when I see a helmet. I think, wow, there's a severed head in there, but I think that's just me being a bit morbid, you know? Some intel down here. What's some intel here, too? The giant craters in Siberia are a mystery. The cause unknown. Locals fear that there are portals to other dimensions or the work of ancient deities. The craters exude a sense of dread and unease, raising questions about the true nature of the world. Experts are puzzled and continue to investigate the cause. Isn't that the picture of the Tunguska incident, which is like a real thing? It's probably like a meteorite falling, right? Well, whatever. Oh, come. Come fight. Excellent. Site 83 was former Soviet military base. It was built sometime during the 1970s. See if you can find a generator. We'll keep this hallway secure. Okay. You guys are gonna be dead when I come back. I've just got a feeling. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be mean. But... I'm not too optimistic about anyone else's survival here. Movement detected in laundry room. Speed, 600 kilometers per hour. For safety reasons, running is discouraged. That's more than running. Oh dear. Since the electrical incident, more objects have been reported missing. Additionally, one member of the security was unaccounted for. I'm unable to allocate him or his signal. We're conducting a thorough search of the facility. It'd be interesting to have a level where there's just one enemy. Like, just occasionally showing up. And the rest is, like, based on exploration and finding horrific stuff. I definitely think there's... I'd let you know what's going on, but I can't speak. You know, like superhuman reflexes, ability to go invisible, but can't speak. Lol. Guess we're 
not going through there. I reckon that I still think they're going to be dead by the time I get back. I've just got this feeling. Wow. Well, they're not here, so that's good. Always a plus. Are we not going to report this in? Nah. Safety warning. Great. Significant increase in recent workplace accidents. 32 injuries. 74 oh. deaths. 102 uncategorized. This game does some really good environmental storytelling. Like, it does it really well with, the, like, the little voiceovers and the, the, the details you see. It's very good. Very well thought out. A lot better than Fear. I, I'm sorry to keep saying this, by the way, but I fucking hate Fear. It's so boring. Um... Well, it just cracked my gas mask. I guess that was one of the hallucinations. Excellent. Can't kill them all. Yeah, this is not good. Not an ideal situation, huh? Subject 83 is now the designation for the mysterious crystal. Our staff reported strange occurrences of objects moving or disappearing. Initially, we believed it was caused by the gas, but we were able to confirm that through security cameras that small objects were indeed disappearing. The camera, as ever, would lose signal during these events. But yeah, like, and again, I fucking hate fear. I think it's just, I think it's just so boring. Even, even the later ones. Like, the third one was okay because it was multiplayer, but it's still not great or anything. And fear one and two. Ugh. Today we witnessed a crystal physically pulling and absorbing several objects within close proximity of it, but we're unsure where they are taken to. We placed several cameras inside and they continue to transmit from a location at least a thousand miles away. Judging by the signal speed, we're coordinating security center team to explore the area and locate the missing guard. Great! We got a crystal of unknown origins drawing in people to a pocket dimension or teleporting them. I guess they take you back to the, takes you back to the shitter every time. They're blind. I don't even know what that is, by the way. Huh. This thing is killing me every time. I don't really know how to get rid of it. Like it's, it doesn't damage your armor. It just kills you. I don't know. I'll stay in stealth. I think I kind of walked into it just then, so maybe that was it. I think I did. I think I'm dead here. It's like patrolling. So this is actual stealth here. Although it's blind and can't make it and can only hear me. I may have a decent chance. Very much do with some health, though. All right, so we have clouds with skulls in that teleport you. Attention, morgue is over capacity. Recommend disposing Shocking. corpses. The nastiest thing is, though, it whittles down your health, not your armor. So your arm is just useless on this mission. So far, I mean, there might well be a situation where it's not later on. We fired an electrical current at the crystal. This time nobody went missing, but we heard voices we couldn't explain. Strangely, none of the recording equipment was able to capture it. In the surveillance room, we noticed the missing security guard's helmet data was suddenly switched on. It was a floor in a yellow fluorescent room. Definitely not part of this facility. Somehow the location looked familiar for us all, though. 
We couldn't recognize some of the logged missing objects in the room. We tried to locate him, but the camera's coordinates are out of range. The latitude and longitude from somewhere off the Gulf of Guinea. Must be a problem with the signal. I don't think it is a problem with the signal. Picking up some strange activity. Got right. the power to the loading bin was activated somehow. Okay, so there's guards. What? That's not good. He is worse. Oh, he hi, is dude. I was just exploring and we found another drone. So these seem to relay secret messages to me. Specifically for me. Which is interesting. User identified subject 106, 106, use, okay, it's just saying this a lot at the moment. Incoming message, your mission is nearing completion. Will it end on your terms or theirs? End of message. Okay. I have no idea how many missions this game has. I don't think it's got that many. I've heard it's quite a short game. I guess you'll find out. This is a 20 hour video. I think we got infiltrated. Or, uh, I don't know, maybe the rescue team. Just trying to play tricks on us. You guys want to see the tomahawk, by the way. We gotta stay focused, stay with the team. It's just trying to separate us. Not gonna happen. Did anyone see that? Who the fuck is that? Everybody get the console! That was fun. Hopefully there's no entity around here again, but we'll find out, I guess, once it grabs me and fucks me. It's a shame they're not completely lethal. You know, like, immediately. Because this is very fun. <laughs> Can I move this? No. Creepy Whispering is probably one of these things around. That was very fun though. My aim with the tomahawk, as you see, though, is not great. More like nomahawk, though. Am I right, guys? <laughs> Got him. These guys, I don't envy their job, I'm gonna be honest with you. They seem to be in a terrible fucking situation. Uh, there's been a great significant increase in patients in the infirmary. The majority of these cases involve accidents with heavy machinery, appears in vision experience, hallucinations, or blacking out while operating equipment. That did not look like a picture of what you just described there. Gonna be 100% level with you, with you about this. God, this is bright as fuck, that flare. Holy shit. Attention. Facility is at over capacity. Oh, shut Food up. Food rations not sufficient. Who cares about fucking capacity? Everyone's dead. There's been a recent ignition. Didn't I just read this? That's weird. I feel like I just picked up the same note twice. Teams have split up into Alpha, Bravo, and Charlie to cover more ground at once. Suddenly, Bravo team emitted loud static from their mic and went radio silent. Alpha and Charlie moved to the location where they found the mutilated remains. Surviving expedition team members requested evac. We still don't know the location. We ordered them to proceed with the search. I must have missed the note, but it looks like they sent a team into, like, the portal from the crystal. Very SCP, that sort of thing, to be honest with you. There's, like, entire SCPs like that. 
Scudium is growing increasingly anxious about the missing guard, and the scientists are curious as to what is happening inside. We're sending a team of 20 of our best security personnel, equipped with cameras and 10 days of supplies, to approach the crystal and try and locate the missing guard. The expedition team approached the crystal, and one by one they were sucked in. Upon arrival, they found themselves in an area consisting entirely of yellow plaster walls, carpets, and fluorescent lights. The team spent a whole day mapping out the area, cover over 30 kilometers, but it looks to be an endless labyrinth. This better not be back rooms! I'm gonna, I'm gonna be so fucking angry! As a commander of the security personnel at Site 83, I wish I could join them, but I have my duties to oversee the mission from here. I will continue to observe and report from the camera feeds. The back room's right. Is the least scary, least, what the fuck? All right, maybe you don't go out there. The least scary, least interesting thing that has ever happened in horror for, for, for centuries, okay? I'm guessing we're gonna have to go this way and it's gonna kick in as I get here, yeah. Are we in the back rooms? Kind of we are. A little bit. It's not quite, is it? But we're definitely tripping balls. I will say, it's kind of refreshing to have a level that's like... So far, at least, not focused on combat that much and has been more like... Exploration and storytelling. Makes a good balance, you know, after the absolute fucking craziness. This is the fuck. Fuck off! Just fuck off! <laughs> just, 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 fuck off. God! I can't believe it! They did it! I, I, God, I'm so angry right now. I'm so fucking. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting rickrolled, but with backrooms lately. <laughs> I don't even know what to say anymore. I don't even know what to fucking say. It's even got the little arrows that you see in the shit indie games. Oh my god. Oh. Oh this is actually the funniest fuck. This is one of the funniest things I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> I just I don't even know anymore. What is life? Oh hang on, there could be some uh creepy creepy kins around here. I hear I hear whispering. Doesn't necessarily mean shit, but better be safe than uh backroomed. That's what they say, you know, that's the saying. Better to be safe than backroomed. I made the right call, I believe. Oh, we're through the jam door. Well, let's just forget that happened. Okay. Anomalous activity detected. Anom? Oh my god. Game is not only a backrooms game, but is stealing our brand. Thought I heard a door there. Actually nearly shat myself. With the expedition team suffering losses, corporate is looking to get involved to prevent the situation from getting worse. They're assembling a team of specialists to take over. The expedition team reported seeing movement in the shadows and hearing voices. We aren't able to observe either through the camera feeds and we're worried they may be hallucinating. Excellent. Uh, I, don't, I haven't really used my guns, so I don't really want to change anything yet. Like, it's not like I've been burning through ammo or need to adapt to the situation because I'm low on ammo at the moment. Well, I've got to turn off the power. Find me. Who the fuck said that? Who the fuck is Box? Like cocks. <laughs> oh great, just fucking wonderful, isn't it? Just fucking brilliant. <laughs> Shut up. Oh, some of our team. 
All right, let's go upstairs first because the game wants me to go downstairs. Oh, it's an elevator. Okay, this is a bit big up here for what I wanted. Let's just keep keep going the uh, other way for now. Like, I'm not trying to 100% this or anything. I don't want to find it. I don't care about all the intel and shit like that. Let's just focus on the story. I'm doing the side missions to unlock guns so the missions are more fun. But guns and mods and, and all that shit are handy. Why is the elevator not coming? I guess it's broken. God damn it. I guess we have to go up and then find a way down, maybe. Listen, I would talk, but that would be far too much effort. It just burns calories that I could be using for slowing down time. As you can see, the fire shotgun is uh, what we call in the business really fucking fun. Okay, I've never seen that happen before. It's dancing! It's dancing! Where the fuck did they come from? I have no idea where I'm going now, I'm going to be honest with you. Can't call this. This is all still bouncing. Bouncing baby body parts. <laughs> oh my god, I should... Oh, I see. I mean, my, my prediction, uh, they haven't made it. Oh, more intel though. These are nice, bit of flavor. Oh God, this is creepy. Day seven, we received loud deafening static from the expedition team members and all camera feeds were cut. The gas alarms went off and everyone ran to get gas masks. Those who weren't able to put one on time, God help them. We radioed the QRF and sent out a distress call. If we could hear any replies, corporate shut off our comms and elevators, probably afraid we'll contact authorities and cause a PR incident. We're all just sheltering in place and hoping someone's coming to get us. Excellent. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? What an arsehole. I guess this is the right way. Someone's definitely fucking with me. And it's not just the spirit of the back rooms. Or maybe it is! Definitely fucking looks like it. I can't actually believe this is real still. Alright, right, squad's in here. Oh, I can't hear his peats. Look at those little peats. God, I'm really bad at aiming. Fuck off. Just fuck off. I'm so angry. <laughs> Are 
Although I do like the idea that these guys are stuck in here as much as I am. Oh, this could suck. <laughs> Definitely gonna suck. The door just removed itself. There's something in here with me, I see it. wobbly woman was fucking with me. How convenient. Again, I don't need it, but still, how convenient. There's insane people that's just like the big guys. They're the, the best fucking thing ever. really have much of a chance, did they? I'm gonna be honest with you. They were very busy being on fire. Yeah, see the fire spreads between them, like they'll step on their burning bodies as they're running round and then they'll be on fire, and then there isn't really a lot they can do. <laughs> they just get fucked. That, that, that high value target lasted what? A shot? And his brain came off. Alright, let's stop getting deeper in. This has been a great level by the way, I know I'm memeing about the back rooms, but I've really enjoyed this. Holy shit, there's our team. Hit it again, we got to destroy this thing! What the fuck is it? Oh, it's the crystal! Of course it is. Derp a derp a derp. I've got a feeling these guys are all gonna get killed by it now. What are they gonna hit it with? A flamethrower? They got like a big gun down there, look. No rush, guys. But it'd be great if you could do something. Something I have come across a few times is events not loading in properly. Uh, there was only having inside missions so far. Twice. And I had to reset, and then they worked fine once I reloaded, but it's still Number interesting. Six. Oh, we knew he'd be alive. Hi. We're trying to destroy this crystal, whatever it's doing, it's... What the... What the fuck? We've lost contact with 106 other teams that may be compromised or KIA. According to Intel, the strong Subject 83 will end the anomalous activities taking place in the area. The prototype laser should be efficient to certain one shot. We need to connect it to the bases. Wonderful. Just fucking great. Oh my god. Is it gonna block all of them? It looks like it is, right? This is really fucking cool, though. It's preserving itself.
I do not. Oh look, their bodies are all getting like sucked in. Yeah. Great. It's probably not the ideal situation we need here. Especially when I have no idea where I should be going or what I should be doing right now. Like everything's blocked off. Right? I can't get near him. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing. Ah, I got one down, I guess. I'm guessing it's not going to like this. I guess kill every squad that arrives. And then we'll uh, gradually weaken the for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why, but... Melee in this is actually really fucking good. What the fuck happened there? Did you see that? Come on, suck him up! Still can't get this one. Which is a bit strange, because I'd assume that would have been one of the ones I could have got, but... Maybe the one underneath now is free? Like, the order they initially, uh... Yeah, this one's free now. Two with a different gun. Oh no, I got some shotgun shells back. Okay, that's fine. Well, that went well, didn't it? Pop, pop, yeah, that's what I like to see. Got old fashioned popping. Those guys got wrecked, by the way. They had no fucking chance. They just got demolished by that shotgun. Can't be all of them, right? Okay, this is nearly charged, you can hear it. Suck though at the same time.
It's not your time. Who the fuck is Vox? Uh, I'm literally right here, Falcon. Holy shit. I have eyes on 106. Picking him up now. Holy shit, that was a badass fucking mission. I loved it. That was the best one so far. We've had some great ones. Site 83 is complete. I don't have any side quests I'm going to unlock, but I will take time off camera to do them. As you can see, I was definitely much more powered up there. In case you're wondering, we couldn't find Phantom anywhere. No other squads, no bodies, no guns, no trace. Not surprised over what we found there. That was cool. That was like an SCP mission. Lots of crazy shit in your last mission. So cool. It's what Horizon doesn't understand. Anomalies aren't meant to be played with. This is so fucking cool. Holy shit, I enjoyed that so much. Alright, what do we unlocked? Oh, no more side quests, actually. We did them all. In that case, we have Horizon HQ. Lead an assault on Horizon HQ. Destroy Horizon once and for all. Genuinely, is this going to be the end of the game? It's a shame if it is, but we'll check it out immediately, I guess. Horizon Islands. Yeah, I don't see anything else, so, uh... Yeah. Coordinates locked. Awaiting for 106 at the helipad. Let me just sort my weapons and shit out, dude. Bro. Bro! Oh, we haven't unlocked rat bombs, <laughs> bolt launcher, or the minigun still, so maybe... How do I unlock it, does it say? Oh, hard difficulties! No! We guess we don't unlock those unless we play on hard, which, I, which I'm not doing, guys, I've got to be honest with you. We want tom hooks again, because they're the best. Can we get... Can we dual wield? Yes, we can! We could dual wield the DMR, I think, but I don't, think, I don't think I want to. I find it hard enough to manage with just one, so uh, we're just going to stick. I think this might be near the end of the game, though. But uh, while it's short, it's very sweet um, if this is the final mission. I'm guessing there'll be some big revelation here, though. There, there might be at least another mission after this. Everything they've done to us and to you. Well, let's see. Let's fucking go. Director, 106 is on board. Moving to rally point. Trapang. What does Trapang mean? I think, like, this is published by a British game publisher, but I don't know about the team that made it. All teams are positioned. 106, once you get those bombs planted, we'll begin the assault. Oh, we're gonna blow up some building. Search. Search. Awesome. I expect there's gonna be a lot of shooting shoot here. Especially after I fuck that up from the start, huh? Oh, fuck. Wow, there's a lot of armor already. There might be a control this way. So, I'll probably get around to it at some point. Like, properly. Probably two videos, it's a long game. Get fucked. Get fucked. Suck a fucking dick. Anyway, what am I doing? Planting bombs, right? There might be some more enemies around. Oh, I see. On these supports. Tomahawks didn't save the day. No! Holy shit, that's a lot of them.
do it. Excellent. Probably change weapons, I don't think the sniper's gonna do very much good here. At least not any more amount of bullets for it. Uh, let's have a look. No, nobody's showing up for my shift. How am I supposed to fix the entire underground system by myself? If I get the security guards to help me out, they're not gonna do anything but a better job. The Horizon Corporation, once leading technology company, is currently facing a major scandal involving unethical research practices and cover-ups. Anonymous hackers have leaked sensitive information revealing the existence of the Pandora Institute, which was supposed to be an end-of-life care center, but was actually coercing patients to sign up for human experimentation. Additionally, it's been revealed the company's covered up deaths of thousands of employees and terrorist attacks, resulting in many employees quitting and disruptions in the company's operations. To make matters worse, the CEO, Anton, Lazar's been blaming the company's problems on a paranoid conspiracy theory about a shadowy group controlling the world from behind the scenes, further damaging the company's reputation. As a result, the company's stock price has plummeted and it's losing money. Wow, all this has happened from us doing a few side quests, I think, more than anything else. I'm gonna be real with you guys, like... We can need a new gun. There's gotta be one knocking around here. I don't want a pistol. A pistol's shite. Oh, I'll take this. It's not amazing, but... That'll do for now. So that was bad. We just absolutely destroyed that entire group in about a few seconds. So uh, I guess it wasn't so bad. I guess I'm just a beast, is what I'm saying. Oh, what's this? Oh, I guess I can just put it down here for now. I guess I'm just the best at video games ever. <laughs> Oh, I like the lift music. Let's go. Charge set. All teams begin the assault. I felt like we did that a bit soon. Like, I'm surprised we're still functioning. Holy shit. I will say, this game runs incredibly nicely and looks really nice and slick. And it just runs at an amazing speed and it just looks cool. I guess one thing this game is doing is, I'm guessing for the most part, you're meant to get ready playability from playing at a high difficulty level and unlocking stuff. Not really my cup of tea, but for an indie game, you know, it's good. Like, fear is too long. Oh shit, hi. Sorry everyone, didn't recognize you. Uh, do I leave this behind? I think I'll swap the shotgun out, I've no bullets left, so. Here we go. I'm guessing there'll be big secrets when we go the Holy shit, there's a lot of troops here, and there's no slow Like, it's nuts. I'm playing this on PC, for the like, I don't really like playing first-person shooters on console. Like, I, I'm primarily a console player, but I don't play first-person shooters on console. Oops. 
Oopsie doopsie. That was our own team. Hazard of the job, right? I'm sure he knew what he was signing up for. Anton, if you do not step down, we will take whatever action necessary to end this madness. Effective immediately, we're funding your 100 million personal security team. If you do not hand yourself over to the authorities immediately, you'll have limited options to defend yourself. Oh shit. Dear Anton Lazar, I am writing to formally resign from my position after learning about the Horizon's illegal activities, including human trafficking and experimentation. I cannot in good conscience continue to work for an organization that participates in such heinous acts. I leave the company's a responsibility to operate ethically and within the bonds of the law, and I refuse to be part of a company that does not uphold these standards. Holy shit! It's Antoine's big fucking bald head there. The dynamic young CEO Anton. Versus Twitter. Little melee, just a little tap. What are you, a baby? I'll read all the intel in a minute. But once we're not getting, like, you know, like, shot to fart constantly. I'm surprised any of you guys survived, I'm gonna be honest with you. That was an absolute fucking clutch. Right there. Find cover. Oh, go. Reloading. Well, that was some absolutely shite shooting by me. my health. Woo! Area clear. Director, we secured the lobby. Horizon senior leadership is hiding on the executive force. Take them out, and Horizon will be finished. Are we sure about this? Welcome to Horizon Towers. I wonder what the twist is gonna be. Like, we were made to... Okay, shut the fuck out, guys. I'm just gonna get in the elevator. I'm just picking up weapons. Fuck. It's true. We are suffering higher attrition this quarter. We are in a growth phase. We are suffering higher attrition this quarter. We aren't going to change. Alright, let's have a look. Uh, dear members of the board, I'm writing to repeal. We're at war and our enemies do not tough fight fairly. Do not believe the distortion of truth presented in recent headlines. It was written by groups who seek to discredit us and prevent the democratization of anomalous technologies. We're on the verge of bringing life-changing science to every person on Earth. Please bear with me. You've trusted me with the ups and downs. These times will be challenging for us all. We can't achieve, we can achieve kind of great, great things by giving up. 
Horizon facilities around the world have come to coordinate attack. The identity of the attackers and their motives are currently unknown, but sources suggest that the attacks are well planned and executed with precision. Though Horizon has called for assistance from local authority, it appears that they're reluctant to intervene. This may be due to lack of sympathy from the recent scandals that have plagued the corporation, including allegations of human trafficking, human experimentation, and the funding of terrorist groups. We are under attack by one of the world's oldest and most corrupt organizations. There's always the option to quit and live another day, but it would be only by delaying the inevitable. If you wish to survive, I urge you to leave immediately. If you wish to stand up and fight, know that you will die here. This is the end of the horizon in my existence. I will fight to the bitter end of the battle we cannot possibly win. I'm fighting for the values we believe in. I'm fighting to send a message. One day that message will swell into a wave of righteousness to the world. It has been my greatest honor to work alongside excellent individuals like yourself, Anton. So are we the Illuminati? Is that who we're working for? I mean, I can believe it. We made mistakes. It's almost over, 106. We'll stop Horizon once and for all. Yeah. 106, I can barely reach you on comms. Something's interfering with the signal. Subject 106, you're not burning down an empire. You're burning down the hopes and dreams of thousands of scientists and innovators. Eh. around you. These aren't military targets, these are civilians. Have you ever noticed how the syndicate is always the aggressor, always the invader? I mean, you did that really fucking terrifying what you're shit. today is injustice. It's genocide. Eh, I'm not convinced, I'm going to be honest with you. Like, okay, we've been always aggressing, but you've had you've, you've had some really fucking dodgy shit going on in your bases. You're not going to convince me that it was like it was okay, right? For them to like get those senior citizens to like you know, sign up for bodily sort of experiments and shit when they were on their last legs and shit so I'm like fuck off evacuate now that's an order like how is that going to convince me in a million Next, fucking sir, years horizon is finished there's nothing to die here for leave while you still can we can't lose the greatest mind of this generation we're staying sir <laughs> well, I just almost killed myself doing that. It wasn't the fucking smartest thing I've done in a while. Employee survey, or our employee satisfaction service just leaked. It was all one star reviews. We need to find a way to cover this up ASAP. Maybe a few incentives to change people's minds. What the fuck? I thought these guys were like something like, oh, we're, the good, we're the goodies. We promise, we're the good people. Yeah, I'm dead here. Oh, hi. Let's see what you have to say. I don't know if we found these on every level, but I feel like we found quite a few of them. I don't know if they were on the side missions. If they were, I definitely missed them. Horizon Tower Massacre, upload complete. High probability of cognitive dissonance if 106 becomes involved in phase 1. Keep him in the underpass until phase 2 of the operation. The cycle is nearly complete. See to it finished correctly this time. Dun dun dun! Well, I mean, this is evidence that there's some shady shit going on on our side, which we knew. Right, we knew there was shady shit going on. Be interesting to see how this wraps up, seeing as they seem to be going for like the conclusion of the story early on. But not early on, but like in this last mission. Oh, bullshit. The fucking grenade got me. Oh, God, I fucking hate the grenades in this game. Like, they're the main thing that's killed me throughout this whole thing. We're staying, sir. That's fine. Let's not lose all my ammo. It was an honor working with you all. Jesus Christ, like, that's what fucked me last time, like. Oh, it keeps me well, that's interesting. Yeah, it does. I'm not gonna look at the drone again, you know.
some of the most ridiculously beautiful open shots I've ever seen. Wow. Yeah. I got a trophy for for destroying 100 beer bottles. Hi. Bye. I feel like I'm validated now by destroying the 100 beer bottles, actually. That doesn't sound good. This could be a final boss fight already. Nah. Moving contact! Down. Ninjas. Fuck up about grenades! Fuck. Keep suppressing! You say my situation is fucked, fallback? Okay. That's what it sounded like. Bye. All our volunteers are in place. It's hasty work, Hamilton, but this is the best we could do. Wish I could have done more for all of you. Oh, he was doing such fucked up shit! Doing, okay, he was doing really fucked up, and unless the implication is everything has been fabricated, but I don't believe that the fucking guys went in there in advance, left notes for me to find to convince me to fight for them. I just don't. I just don't buy it, it's just weird. Whose room is this? Uh, calling any person on the media exceed the following requirements. Chrono Kratia over 1 lake pounds at IQ 40, master's degree and high, you need for emergency project immediately. Huh. Guess this is probably all to do with me, or to like to convince me, or do something with me, or something with me. Me, me, me. Everything about me. It's always about me. Right? Let's whack an incendiary mode on this while I'm here. Oh, well, definitely going in for a final battle here. Like, Jesus Christ. I'm not going to take the this gun, though. I'm going to take the DMR again. Now I've got a full load of bullets for art. These are my two favorite guns, so we'll take these. Like, holy fucking shit, though. Like, <laughs> like I mean, seriously. If this is, if this is the final battle, I'm going to be intrigued. Well, looks like something's happening, at least. Six. What have they done to you? Me. I've sacrificed everything for this! Oh shit. He's uploading his consciousness. You have to stop him. Okay, what do I do? Tossing a flare. You don't know what you're doing. Suppressive! He's over there! Where's he uploading his brain? 
Oh my god, I hate when that happens. Oh, it checkpointed there? Oh, that's incredibly lean. What the fuck? I guess it wasn't bullshit at all. I need ammo though still. Alright. 
guess we're getting in. Oh shit, we just punched his face in! Holy shit, that was brutal! Surely that isn't the end of the game. It just says break the cycle on my screen there. Are they gonna execute me or some shit? I'm curious now what's gonna happen. Maybe no, it's not the end of the game, it doesn't look like. Oh! Oh my god, it was a You're our most valuable asset, 106. You served the syndicate well. It's time for you to retire. Oh my fucking god! Why did we trust the evil corporation? Why? Why? It was always meant to end this way. Wow. You're one of the many cycles, 106. That never happened. I want to do that. That was badass. Oh shit, this is from the start of the game. Oh, these were all previous 106s. Each of you were created for a special purpose. The enemy triumphs today, but our sacrifice will not be. Didn't seem to go that well, though, really, did it? Let's be honest. If only you knew. You can't do this to me. I've sacrificed everything for this! Now that your purpose is fulfilled... We literally are the Illuminati, the director's side. Cycle 106 is complete. Oh, shit. I don't fully understand, but... You know, it is what it is. Are we going to escape? Is that going to be a twist? Or is this the end? Still says break the cycle, so I guess there's more. Acknowledged. Terminate cycle 106. Oh, they're about to burn us. Holy shit. He served us well. Oh my god, this is fucked! Oh shit! All units be advised. Subject 106 is active. Continue oh shit! Oh shit! This is badass! Oh, we got another level! Terminate Rogue Asset 7891, respective organizations. No armor and speed improvements recommended for next cycle. Next cycle, though. Oh, fuck. Where was that from? I am fucked here. Holy shit. I should stand it for myself. He's on fucking happening. I'd rather poo Bob Wyatt than uh, be friends with you again. I'm gonna be honest with you. Close. Director, 
106 is going for the silo. Attention, all units! All our friends are trying to kill us. Oh shit, are we gonna blow up the nuke? We, I, we're totally gonna blow up the nuke. Get fucking fucked. You think you can fucking stop me? I'm Agent Nomkin 106, bitch! We're gonna nuke this entire place. Yeah, we fucking did. They're gonna make a new. Uh, what, they're gonna make a 107 to find me, I'm guessing. Shield guys, okay, I got on the back at least. Come on, where the fuck are they? Bullshit. Just everywhere. This is gonna be super tough for a final mission. I can do it. I'm confident. Oh, that was okay. Garbo checkpoint. Holy shit. A really bad one. Please give me a checkpoint. Please give me a checkpoint. I'm sorry I didn't speak much there. I was really fucking hardcore. Tricor. Tri Tricor? Trying. Trying super fucking hard there. Systems critical. This whole damn facility starting to fall apart. Oh yeah, we know what time it is, guys. It's incendiary fucking time. All right, I guess this is the next one uh, uh, in the cycle. Initiating cycle one zero seven. Yeah, I was gonna say, this is what we look like. I thought we were just a dude. Oh great. Problem. I have no ammo. Did I miss a bunch of armor and shit before? Oh, 
playing the boss. Okay, I'm so fucking gay. Kind of just in the way, because you're like normal dudes. See? Alright, 107's back up. That was just comic! What the fuck is happening? Oh, we can't dual wield anymore because we don't have an arm. Oh, and we reload slower too. Oh, that's kind of, kind of cool, but also really annoying. Shotgun is still doing his fucking job and just fucking these dickheads up. not expect this to escalate as much as it has. Hello, little guy. Can you give me my arm back? That would be great if you could. User identified, subject 106, location, syndicate cloning facility, accessing user memory. So we're a clone, get it? And we get improved every time. Access attempt successful, uploading. Data package, syndicate cloning activity, uploaded, complete, accessing network. Access attempt successful, verifying data, data package subject 105 termination, status verified, data package in Pandora Institute, evidence of anomalous research, status verified, data package mission to terminate subject 91, status incomplete, when was that? I don't remember any of these. Okay. Oh, we missed one of them, right? There is no extraction. Destroy the facility. You will be remembered. Break the cycle. Press any key to continue. Oh, we didn't find all the drones. That's a shame. But... We can at least go and press the nuke button. Which is clearly what it wants us to do. Alright, we're full armor. We're full ammo and health. Oh, here's the nuke. And probably 107, I'm going to guess as well. Do we look like you? That's like cheating. like fucking
probably the best way of dealing with this fucker, really. He hits so fucking hard. Oh my god, shoot him! That was a waste of fucking armor, god damn it. I don't like the way the instant the instant load menu comes up either. It like it actually fucks you sometimes quite a bit. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Anyway, guys, the first time I think I need to edit this properly. I'm gonna be back once I've beaten this guy, but it's probably gonna take me a few tries because this this seems like like top tier bullshit. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't really know what I'm gonna do. So see you in a second. All right. I'm on the next phase now. Much better health than last night. I'd say play immediately. Get God, can I survive this? I don't know. Soul. That was a tough fight, by the way. It's only like five tries. There's a lot of clones down here. We are not in great shape, but we're going to hit the nuke, I'm pretty sure, here. And break the cycle. Oh my god. What a nonky. Hi. Goodbye. And that's the nuke from the opening sequence. I thought this was excellent. Really good little game. Story isn't like the best, but it has some really good touches and really good sections. I thought overall this was a uh, an excellent little tribute to fear that exceeds the quality of the original by a large margin. It could do with being a little tad longer, I can't believe I'm saying that, it could do with being a little bit longer. Um, maybe like an extra mission or two, but generally speaking, this was excellent and I really enjoyed it and um, I hope you guys did too. It's part of my mission to try and bring some different types of horror to the channel, doing some things like this. And you know, first-person shooters, Metroidvanias, Souls-likes, things like that mixed in with the usual. I think it's uh, working out fairly well at the moment, so, um, yeah, I think that's it. Anyway, we got some Subject 106 published data to anonymous sources done. Initiating reconstruction from memories. Compiling data from Subject 106 memories. Memories incomplete. Reconstruction unavailable. Signing off. Ah, oh, because I didn't get all the things. Okay, I guess there's like a true ending. Oh, I got no, actually, I got, I got the, I got the trophy, the truth. Let the world know. But regardless, I thought this was cool, and um, these guys deserve a lot of praise for Trapang. It's not, I keep saying Trapang Two. Trapang Squared is what it actually is. It's not Trapang Two. Anyway, thank you so much. Uh, let's look at the cheats quickly. Wow, look at the things you can turn on. Squeaky voices, can't reload, knife bullets. Oh, I want clumsy enemies in big head mode. God damn it. Spooky mode, sandbox, knife bullets. Some really fun shit. I really enjoyed this. If you enjoy our content here, you enjoy these long plays, make sure you consider supporting us by hitting that link in the description, guys, to our Patreon. We need 18. 18 new patrons this month to hit our goal. Even a dollar goes towards that. 
If you can help us out at all, consider doing that and being an amazing nomkin. Just pledge that buck if you can. It helps us out so much. And I'll see you really soon for more spooky dookie times. See you later. Goodbye.